Hey guys, I know my pods here and today I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak without um losing your jailbreak and your themes and your uh all you have in it. So you just wanna hook up and um make sure it's a two two G and um it's all synced up. After that you can minimize um iTunes and just gonna show you this that is still Joe Birkin. Uh, my Cydia app just won't go, it just crashes. As you guys see. So I'm gonna restore here. So you're gonna go into link in the description and download this. It's a uh, it's a zip file. Just open that up. And then you're going to the red snow file. And then you are going to red snow dot uh, exe. Okay, this is the un untethered jailbreak. So what you're gonna do is put in DFU mode. Um, as I say here, either connect in DFU mode or just push enter to uh, entry into DFU mode. Okay, any key to continue? Yeah. So let me just put in D. Let me just put in DFU mode first. And uh, we will go into the uh, red snow. So this is how you do it. Just hold the home button and the power button for 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold down the home button and release the power button until you hear the chime in your windows. And there you have it. It's in the FM mode. Um, it should be non-responsive. Um, so let's open up redsnow.exe. And it says DFU mode successful. And then it's going to do all its stuff. Right there. And it should flash a few times. And it should do this downloading jailbreak data and um guys I'm um, sorry if you guys are hearing that my that's my brother crying okay there you have it jailbroken data and uh, iTunes should pop up any minute now but mine's not popping up and I'll just close the um, red snow and just gonna do its thing you know, don't have to worry. So let's just wait. Um, this I actually um watched the Will DTA video. It's the same thing, but if you go into my link in the description, you guys could download this file. No problems. Um. My iPod was not as responsive. Um, then I tried it out, and um, it's it working now. So um, the next video I'm gonna make is um, the cut, copy, and paste for the iPhone app I touch 2G. As you guys have seen, is this a version of QuickPwn. They just need to update a QuickPwn and put this little program. It's RedSnow.exe. Now it's flashing the nor. And then let's open up README text. And this is what it says Red Snow. This is a release uh, only for the uh, for the iPod Touch 2G. Versions are available for Windows, Linux, and Mac. So it's not available for Ubuntu. Uh, instructions and yada yada yada. So let's just exit out of that. And there you have it. It's almost done. It's rebooting. And there we have it. The beloved Apple logo. 2G iPod. Untether jailbreak. Without losing anything on your um, on your iPod. Even though if you put it on DFMU mode. And uh, it just found my iPod
right there to transfer the photos. Let's close that. And um, it's, it's going. And uh, we are already in five minutes. Sorry about that, guys. But I did say we're going to have a job working video. And if it takes too long to um, reboot, just sit aside. Don't mess up with it. But if it takes too long, like you, you uh, let it overnight and it's still on this, try to um, um, force it to uh, reboot, like holding these two together until it's just shut off and brings back the Apple logo. But don't let go of the power button or you're going to put it in the FME mode. So any time now, it should come up. Back right there. There's my Will DTA team. And there you have it guys, the untethered jailbreak. You don't have to be jailbroken to do this. Right there, all of my apps still there.